Wenatchee Valley Real Estate Market Update, October 2022. Hi everyone, it's Nick McLean, owner of the Nick McLean Real Estate Group, and I'm about to share with you the recent report on the market and how it's gonna affect the future real estate market. Right now we're seeing a reversal in overall sales. In fact, sales are down 13% compared to last month. They're down 8% year over year. So there's fewer homes selling. Now, we used to say the reason why you're seeing fewer and fewer homes selling is because inventory is so low, there's nothing to buy. There's all this demand, but there's nothing to sell the buyers. Well, that's changed because we're also seeing inventory rise. See, inventory is up 3% compared to last month when it should be going down. See, seasonally, as you go into the fall and winter months, fewer and fewer, fewer people go onto the marketplace. But we're seeing the exact opposite happen this year. So is this foreshadowing what to expect come spring? If people are thinking about putting their homes on the market and are putting their homes on the market this fall and winter, what are they going to do next spring in 2023 when they want to put their home on the market, when the flowers are out? I predict it's going to be crazy. I think there's going to be a tidal wave of new homes hitting the marketplace. The homes that we're seeing hit the marketplace right now have been new construction. We did a video, I don't know, a couple weeks ago about the, the four hallmarks of an impending housing market apocalypse. It was a little dramatic, but the hallmarks of a housing crash or housing depreciation of price starts with new construction. The first hallmark is there's an oversupply or builders have overbuilt for the amount of demand. And right now, I just looked it up, 25% of all of the active listings in the Wenatchee Valley, 25% are new construction homes owned by builders. So what happened was when interest rates popped from three to seven, new, the builders know what's gonna happen. They know affordability just got shot. So they put they dumped all their inventory trying to trying to get rid of their inventory before it's too late, before the winter starts, right? So you have all this new inventory. Well, that's going to affect pricing quite a bit. Um, but that's not going to, that's not, hasn't really shown up yet because it's still a seller's market. The average supply is around three months of inventory right now. So this is a saving grace for everyone that's watching this that owns a home. The price of your home hasn't really gone down. Like it's stabilized as they would say it positively, but it's really just reversed the trend. But this spring, in the spring of 2023, that trend may be on the, on the backside and it might be a negative uh, situation for homeowners in the Valley. So a lot of homeowners that own homes, you might consider finding out what your home's worth. You might consider putting on the market in the winter versus the spring. We're gonna shoot another video and talk to, talk to you about how you consider the pros and cons of both. But overall, the real estate market is seeing a decline in sales because of, uh, because of interest rates. They're seeing more new construction hit the marketplace. We're seeing more homes hit the market in the winter, the fall and winter months when normally it declines. So that's what's going on in the real estate marketplace. If you have any idea or have any questions about what's going on, you need real estate advice, reach out to a team. We'll be happy to help you. Um, we're going to be, re we're going to be keeping track of the trends every single day as we move forward because we're still selling homes. We're still helping buyers from Seattle, Bellevue, Redmond, California, outside people move to the area, being very successful selling homes in Chelan, Leavenworth, Wenatchee that aren't affected by interest rates, right? So cash buyers, huge down payment buyers, they're still purchasing homes. Um, so there's still a positivity in terms of like, people still believe in home ownership and our area in terms of the Wenatchee Valley, people still want to live here. So we're not immune to depreciating prices, but we're we're a little bit, we have a little bit of a defense here. So we have some protection. And so there's still time for you guys to evaluate where you're at. So if you have any questions, reach out to your team. We're here for you as your local real estate experts.